It's been reported by Russia Today, RT, in 2016 that the country of Japan and their government is joining NATO for a humanitarian effort by modernizing militarization in the military by joining NATO and building their missile building consortium for, humer for, for humanitarian aid and disaster relief operations. The Japanese government proves this political humanitarian effort to be peaceful. The ships will be used in anti-submarine warfare. JMSDF is joining NATO in this humanitarian effort as well. The countries of China, Taiwan, and Russia as well too. Overseas military deployment has begun. However, Japanese citizens have been protesting against these humanitarian efforts with picket signs saying war is over and give peace a chance. Activists and whistleblowers have been rallying against the military effort from JMSDF. Citizens and news media believe it's to encourage more wars. A lot of controversial moves have been made by JMS, JMSDF and Prime Minister Shinzo Abe. Whistleblowers from various news organizations in the country of Japan and other countries from across the globe have been calling the Japanese government and Prime Minister Abe Shinzo out. Despite all the negative press, militaristic actions are being launched by the JMSDF.